In this series, I place an emoji on all of our targets, whether I end up being a gold digger or not, in order to be respectful, prevent any defamation, and keep you all guessing. Oh yeah, I also don't want to get sued. Your love is like a hurricane, so I gotta run from you. I gotta run from you, yeah. So I gotta run from you, yeah. What is up, you guys, and welcome back to another episode of Cat gold diggers i know it has been a while but there's just been so much stuff that went on in the past couple of months but the important thing is that we are back baby and i'm chilling here with the homie david hey, what's going on guys as i'm sure you guys know david is here with me because he wants to put his girl to the gold digger test Woo! okay so david let's have the uh, audience get to know you a little bit shall we yeah. how long have you and your girl been dating uh, it's been about three to five weeks, a little bit over a three month. Three to five weeks. Yeah. And how exactly did you guys meet? Um, so I'm a music producer. And she's a singer. So we decided to work on a track together. And like ever since then, we kind of hit it off. You mm -hmm. know, we started dating after that. So, so it sounds like you guys are kind of like a pirate couple, you know? It sounds like you guys are your yeah. producer, she's a singer. Why are we sitting here? What's up? What's going on? Well, Why to be do you honest, think she's a gold digger? I feel like I'm being used to get mm. straight to the point. I've tried to be romantic with her. She kind of brushes it yeah. off. Mm -hmm. I don't know. It's weird. I, I feel like it's not really being genuine. Yeah. But when it comes to talking about the music, when it comes to talking about her vocal, the marketing behind it, how everything's going, if we're close to finishing up. She's all about the conversation, you know? Okay. I, I have a feeling like, what if I finish this track and then the relationship is done? You know? Dang. But. <laughs> Yeah, man, just Dang. Well, guys, and that's exactly why we are here because today we are going to find out if. What was your girlfriend's name again? I'm Melanie. Sorry. Melanie. Melanie. Today we are going to find out if Melanie is simply using David for his talent and money or if she actually is with him because she actually loves him. Nah. Guys, it's almost time for David's date. However, we still have a couple more things left to do. Like, David, you still need to call Melanie and confirm that. So, why don't you go ahead and do that right now? I have to make sure our equipment is ready to go. I still have to shower and change. And I got to make sure that Jordan's doing his job, which I'm looking at him right now. And he's just not doing his job. Hello? Hey, what's going on? What's up? Um, not. I just wanted to call and make sure you'll be ready in like a couple hours. Are we still up for today? Oh, yeah, for sure. Okay, cool. I'm going to bring a friend with me, though. That's cool. Guys, Jordan had one job and one job only. His job was to gather a bunch of bottles and put them into big bags. What do you call this? A little bit of bottles and little bags. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's because we're going to go to work together right after, so it just like, makes more sense. Yeah, yeah, no, that, that's that's cool. Um, right. I'm running a little late, so I'll just, I'll just see you soon, okay? All right, see you later. All right, bye. bye. You need to dive into like five more dumpsters. No. <laughs> no. no. <laughs> Come on. She just told me right now that she's bringing a friend on our date. This is supposed to be a date with me and her. I'm trying to be romantic and she just told me she's bringing a friend. Like this is, this is ridiculous. I'm just kidding guys. We're not gonna make Jordan dumpster dive. What we're going to do is we're gonna go to the store. We're gonna buy packets of water, probably like three or four. We're gonna empty those out into another water jug so that we don't waste any water. And then use those bottles and cans to fill up bags. We need like two or three big ones. I wasn't dumpster diving. And you need to change. Okay. <laughs> okay. He was dumpster diving okay. for those kids. <laughs> he needs to change this to something more smelly. So what's good, David? Are we good? Man, Are we good? I just called her right now to confirm and she just told me that she's bringing her coworker along with her. Her coworker? I mean, I guess they're going to work afterwards, but I don't, I don't know, man. Like, this is exactly what I'm talking about. You know, I try and make a nice romantic date, and right. she brings someone along to kind of ruin it. So, I mean, should we still do it? Yeah, you're so, gone. Do you want to still do yeah, it? Or yeah, do you yeah, yeah. Let's, 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 we, we let's can do, do it another day. If you want to do it another day? Nah, like let's just do it. Let's just do it. We've already Are put the sure? work in. Let's just do it. Dude. Sounds good. Then, in that yeah. case, freshen up, go change, go shower, cut your hair if you want to cut your hair. You need to look smelly, so you don't need a shower. Do look it. smelly. <laughs> He's playing the smelly guy <laughs> with a bunch of cans, so you don't got to shower. I'm gonna be smelly though. Just change. Okay. I'm gonna go home, freshen up, and change myself. Cool. Sounds good. Cool. All right, David. Um, 
we're gonna need her like somewhere over here, okay? And but just text her and double check that she's still on her way and everything, and just let me know when she's like 10 minutes out. All right, guys, so everything is set up and ready to go. All the cameras are in position, everyone's in position. David is sitting right now texting his girlfriend, and oof, it's been a while, but ready, 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 ready. Oh, she's here. She is here. He's standing up. <laughs> He's like standing awkwardly right there. <laughs> okay, there she is. All right, guys, we have eyes on the package. They're meeting. Okay, let's see. This is all you. David's gonna make up an excuse right now, which means that I gotta get into position. Come on, come on, come on, Zinzo, Zinzo, you come. David, what up? Hey, what's okay. Going on? Okay, you're just gonna go all the way down. Denzel's gonna take you. The camera's right there. You're gonna have headphones to listen to everything that I'm gonna say, okay? Me and Lance right. are on a phone call already. Perfect. Whew. Ready for this? Let's do it. Okay, here we go. Let's do it, man. Hi, excuse me. Hi. My name's Sergio. Sorry to interrupt, but I was actually wondering if you knew where the nearest recycling center was. No, I don't. I'm trying to take these cans. How much money do you think I got here? 100 bucks? <laughs> My mom used to recycle. She used to have like 10 times more than that. Uh -huh. She would have got like 40 bucks. What the hell? Well, that means I'm not getting shit for this then. It means I'm probably getting like $2 for this. <laughs> Watch, I bet you once the money flashes, she's going to start smiling. So you don't know of any near recycling centers? Like, I mean, I know of one, but it's like 15 minutes out. No, I mean, I could check on my phone. If you wouldn't mind, actually, that'd be great. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. What's your name again? I'm sorry. Melanie. Melanie. So yeah, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. My name was Sergio. Uh, <laughs> uh, there's one like two miles away. Two miles oh, away? No, one mile away. Cool, cool, cool. What streets exactly? Um, Would you mind if I actually put my number in your phone? That way I can uh, call you and we can go on a date or something. No. <laughs> Come on. You can't. Why? Why can't you? I have a boyfriend. What? You're lying. You don't yeah, he wants his car, so he'll be back soon. <laughs> Uh, Wait, so where was it again? The nearest recycling center? Uh, hey, she, 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 she had to pee. Yeah, yeah I know. I know. No worries. She found, a, she found a closer recycling center. Oh, closer one? Yeah, yeah. Oh, it was like two miles away. Where, where was it? Yeah. You want to show them the map? You want to you see the map really quick? Yeah, where were the main cross streets? It's, it's, it's okay. I know where. I know where. Sunset and Hollywood. Something like that. It's around Sunset. Just walk okay. down Sunset and you'll find it. Okay. Hey, but before Thanks. you leave, wait. Come here. Because I want to bless you today, Jordan. No. I want you to have all of it. No. Are you serious? <laughs> I'm serious. It's it's a bonus, man. I don't no. need it. It's a bonus. I don't need it. It's, 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 put it away for someone. It's all yours. Thank man. you it's so all yours. much. <laughs> it's all yours. Hey, are you well, sure? I can't. I, no. I don't. Jordan, all I want is that you spend that money wisely. You don't use it for anything that you don't need. You got it? Cool. Oh, yeah. Awesome, Jordan. <laughs> yeah, of course, Jordan. You have a great day, man. Bye. You have a great day. Doesn't it feel like so awesome to like give back? Yeah, that was a lot of money. <laughs> I know, I know. Like honestly, I don't need it. I'm a music manager, so I manage people oh, really? in the music industry. Yeah. Oh, so I've managed like a couple like big singers and stuff, and they've actually performed like really well this year. Uh -huh. And so that was just a bonus. I have more at home. I have more than I need, you know. So whenever I can give back, I always end up giving back, you know. So. Oh, that's nice. But um, yeah. So I really don't want to leave here without getting your number, please. Let me take you out on a beautiful day. Let me treat you like a queen. The offer's gonna be off the table in five seconds. Five, four, okay. three, yeah? yeah, two, one, sure. yes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Your name was Melanie. Yes, Melanie. Can I save it with a heart emoji next to it? I mean, I guess. That's so <laughs> okay. Cool. I'll give you a text or a call. I'm actually super busy right now. I gotta get going, but I'll give you a text or a call whenever we'll hang out and stuff. Keep looking at this, y'all. Because I just don't want, you know, like a hit it and quit it type of thing or like where you use me for my money. I mean, I'm, no, I'm not that type of girl. You're not that type of girl. I know. Okay, cool. <laughs> okay. So I will. Absolutely. Have a great day. Bye. She's using you, man. She's using you. Either for the clout or for the money, but she's using you. I don't know how to feel about this, man. Like, mm -hmm. Well, you were was, right. That's you know, sure. I mean, I, I was kind of hoping I wasn't right, to be completely honest, because I, I care about this mm -hmm. girl, but... Has she texted you or called you or told you anything? Like, no, you right? how long you think? It's been like, what, like 10 minutes, Yeah, right? it's been about a little bit over 10 minutes, but she doesn't care. I'm telling you, like, there's little things like that. She doesn't care she how long care. you're gone and like, stuff? Yeah, she doesn't care. She's probably taking advantage of the time to be away from me. You know what I'm saying? Like, even after the second <laughs> week... Huh? She's with some guy. She's with some guy? What? Are you just trying to get her number or something? I mean, it looks <laughs> like it. No, you know who that is? That's her friend. That's her coworker. 
Oh yeah, yeah that's yeah, a coworker. Just that makes sense. Was coming. Yeah. All right. Do you want to do you want to go confront her with him there, or you want him to walk away? I mean, I, we can go up to him and be like, hey, like, do you mind stepping inside for a little bit? I mean, wait. I think they kissed. What do you mean? They, they what? kissed. I think they kissed. What do you mean? Like they actually I kissed? Think kissed? I kissed? Saw, kissed? Yeah. What? You gotta be kidding me. No. Dude, dude, dude. I'm done. No. I'm, I'm gonna go confront her right no. now. No. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on, dick. Let, let me call her, let me ask her, let me ask her like, hey, are you sure about this? Do you want to actually go on a date with me and so on? Like, what happened to your boyfriend? And I'm going to ask her like, who that is. Hello? Hey, Melanie, it's Sergio. Hi. What's up? How are you? I'm good. How are you? Good. I was just calling to confirm that you actually wanted to go on a date with me? That you didn't want to like back out or anything? Okay. I remember that you said he had a boyfriend, so I don't want to be the one who causes you to cheat on him, you know? Or I don't want to. I, I don't. I don't want to break up any relationship that you have going in. Like I completely understand. You know, you got a boyfriend. I'm coming in between you guys. That's cool. Like I don't want to do that. You know. So you don't have a boyfriend. No, I don't. You don't have a boyfriend, and you're down to go on a date with me. Yeah. Okay. Um. Also, also, I was I was over here by my car, and I see like some guy next to you. Like, is that like? Is he, are you like okay? Like, is he bugging you? Is he like um? Sounds good then. I just wanted to make sure you were safe. Okay. Yeah, I know. Okay. Um, I'll talk to you later, and I'll see you later. Okay. Cool. Okay. Bye. Uh huh. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. There it is. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready for this. Okay. Let's do this right. Let's get the cameras ready. Get Leslie ready. Get Danny ready. Let's do this. Okay. Okay. So for some reason, Melanie's friend is walking all the way down there. Now I don't exactly know why. Maybe at his restroom, or just maybe the fact that I told Melanie that I can see her from my car kind of freaked her out or something. Or maybe she thought that David could see him or something. I don't know. But let's go do this confrontation. What is up, guys? I hope you guys are enjoying the episode so far. If you guys are, I got some very, very, very good news for you guys. Remember a long time ago, I told you guys that we would start doing Gold Digger pranks again when the time was right? Well, that time is now. We are back to uploading weekly Gold Digger videos. And if you guys are enjoying this series, I can guarantee you guys that you guys will enjoy our new and improved Challenge Roulette series. That series will be coming out this November, and we'll have a trailer for you guys really, really soon. Anyways, guys, here comes the confrontation, so sit back and relax, and I hope you guys have your talkies, because you guys already know, this shit's gonna be good. You give my boy your number, and I saw your homie come over here. He kissed you. Matter of fact, where's your friend right now? You told me your friend was here. Where is he? David, Where is he? David, is he over here? Down? You're acting hella crazy. David, the one making me crazy. Okay. We're not you here to start. Pro we're not here to start problems. Though we're here to confront her. We're here to. You haven't even told me what's going on. Right? Don't act like you don't know what's happening right now. You know you gave yeah. Sergio your number, right? Yeah. You see yeah, all these cameras right here, right? So, so you know everything's planned. Don't try and act like you don't know what's going on. Can right you now. stop yelling at me? How do you expect me to react? You think I'm gonna be nice and sweet to you after you did something so foul to me? No, I'm Get not. Get the hell out of here with that. I'm not yes. saying you have to be nice and sweet to me, but talk to me like I'm an adult and not like I'm in high school. Oh, okay. You're okay. overreacting to it, like for real. How is he talking to you like he's in high school stuff? Because he's yelling at I me. Like I, per I personally crazy. don't even think he's overreacting though. I think he's underreacting. I think he could be more angry and more yelling at you. Like you literally you gave me your number and you kissed your friend or your co-worker or whatever mad. he is. Okay. He has the right to be mad, okay, right? Okay, and I'm not saying he can't be mad, but he needs to calm down because there's two sides to every story. Calm down. Don't tell there's me two down. sides to every story, and if he's going to be acting like that, I'm not going to tell you my, my side of the story. Say your side. He's me. acting like he's going to fight Francisco, and I, I want to... Why don't you call Francisco? Hey, hey Francisco! <laughs> Come get your girl, go yeah, to the see, this is gun. exactly <laughs> what I'm talking about. That's exactly what I'm talking about. Where did Francisco go? I, I don't know. Okay, well, say your side of the story. No, yeah, I don't yeah, want to. I don't want to because yeah. he's not going to listen. You have a right to defend I'll yourself. Listen. Defend I'll give you the yourself. Time. Go ahead. Of the story. Do you want to listen just so you can get like, no, more footage in this little video? Got the I'm just going to listen. Go ahead. I want to hear what you have no, to say. I... Why did you give him your number? Because like every other girl gives a guy her number. Oh, yeah, like, it doesn't mean anything. It didn't mean anything. Whatever, bro. Nothing was going to happen. That's hard to believe. That's I don't believe that's true at all. Okay, well, that's what it is. Right after you give me your number, like five minutes later, I call you up and I say, hey, yo, are you sure you want to do this? Are you sure? Do you want to go on a date with me? And you're like, yeah, I'm down, I'm down. Then I ask you. 
you if mean? you have a boyfriend and you said no, you completely okay. denied even having a boyfriend to okay. me. You were like all for it. Like no, I didn't explain I that. I mean, that's what I said, but I wasn't gonna do anything. <laughs> so it doesn't matter. You weren't gonna do anything with me, but you did do something with Francisco. You kissed Francisco. No, I Francisco. did not kiss Francisco. Francisco kissed me. He's always on me. He likes me. Like so he's the one that did it. I didn't do anything. So you let him kiss you. So I mean, he went in for the kiss and you didn't go for it. In no, for the kiss I also. didn't. It was him. It's on camera though. It, it looks like you went in for the kiss also. It was him. It wasn't me. So you're saying hand up. You couldn't push him away or nothing. You just allowed it happen. So you're saying you, you just let it happen. I mean, he it was him. He pretty much forced it yeah, upon you. Yeah, so pretty much it. he sexually assaulted I mean, you. Call it what type you of want, thing. But it was him. It wasn't That's me. That's a so. gigantic allegation. Okay. Like David just wants the truth out, and okay. we're just here to pretty much just confront okay. you with the truth. Would you mind calling Francisco over here so we can talk no, to him? Would you like to talk to Francisco? Yeah, I want to. But talk we're not gonna we're not to start no, problems no, or nothing. No, just to like talk to him and just to confront. Could you call him over here, please, and just tell him and just tell him to come? Why would you be with someone? Francisco, Francisco, can you come over here, please? If you were someone who's trying to be with you, you're not trying to be with them. Why would you? Does Francisco know you have a boyfriend? Nice person, David. That's why. Uh, there's I'm a nice big person. difference between being a nice person okay. and giving someone the time to. Does Francisco know that you have a boyfriend? Like, get the f out of he knows. Here. Then why would he kiss you? Is know. what I don't get. Asking. Or why would you let him kiss you? Is what I don't get. If he knows that you have. If, 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 it honestly, to me, it honestly didn't look like it was the first okay, time that well, I. Where, where did he walk off to? This way or that way? Um, I that way. I just thought I'm gonna go chill. Like that's it. She's a bullshit, bro. I think that's him over there from distance, right? Okay, why does it look like he's hiding then? Why isn't he like next to you? Why isn't he like no, no, no. right there? I'm about to ask him all these questions, so why don't you ask him why he's standing up? <laughs> I'm gonna go brief him on everything that's happening, and then I'm gonna come back up here. But like, no problem, so please, yeah, just yeah. just straight talking. Can you listen? Can you listen to me? To what? Because to your lies? no, I'm not lying Man. to you. Like he's about to come over here and tell you some stuff. You it's not true. Eyes, yes, I can. Kiss. It's not true. Leslie, go ahead and just point the camera at him, or point the camera at both of us, and then I'll just sum that off, cover his face or something. Wow, this is insane. Francisco, yeah, yeah. that's your name? What's up, man? My name's Sergio. Hi. I apologize about the, I apologize about this camera. Okay. Uh, we're actually making a YouTube video and stuff. Um, okay, it's okay. a pretty serious YouTube video, though. Um, okay. I know that you're here with Melanie. Yes. And I just got to ask you, like, you know, what exactly are you doing? Just know I come here, like, on good terms. I don't want to start any problems with you or nothing like that. I just you know, want like, to ask you why you want to ask that. Well, <laughs> it's a long story. He's literally just a homie. You know what? Like, I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear it. All right, let's see, let's so. see what Francisco has okay, to say. Okay, okay. Whatever, like, talk to him. All right, talk to him. Are you like a coworker or something? No, nah, no, I'm not a coworker. I just drove over here because she said you she, drove over here. Yeah, she wanted really? to do uh, singing with her friend. She, and well, up. she didn't say who was driving, but she made it seem as if she drove here when David was calling her and like, hey, like, no, no, are no, you coming? I drove. You drove. Here. Yeah, okay, I because she had told David that she was driving here with her coworker because you guys had to, like work or something like afterwards. So they were supposed to like hang out for like an hour or something, and then afterwards they were gonna go to work. So what were you guys doing? Were you guys hanging out beforehand? Yeah, yeah, we were. And like then, hanging out or like a date? Just a date. Like a day, you know, like a regular day, you know. This girl's playing you okay. straight up. Yeah. She's playing David. If it were real, she would have been playing me too. Yeah, you yeah. got me. So I, you. I was curious if you wanted to go up there with me. Yeah, yeah, we could go and handle this all out. <laughs> um, <laughs> she's saying a bunch of shit about you also, man. David, Francisco, Francisco, this is David. No, I'm, I'm not. I'm not gonna shake your hand, bro. I have one question for you. Okay, okay. Did you know that me and her were dating? Nah, I did not know. You no, swear, yes, bro. you did. How, you you knew. I told you. Look, I met her two weeks ago. She you gave knew. me her number. I called her up. I told her you got a boyfriend. She said no. I'm single. And Yo, I'm here, you know? you're a Pretty liar. Much the same you're, you're lying. It's hard to say that he's lying because right. you said the same thing to you, though. I told you, though. every time lying, we hung bro. out, I told you I had a boyfriend, nah. and you always kissed me. Nah, you were always talking lying. about, don't Come call on, me no bitch, you're a bitch, bro. Nah, I call you whatever you want. You no, 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 you don't. No, you don't. No, you, don't. Yeah. No, you, don't. Yeah. It, 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 you said the same exact thing to me. I called you up, and I was like, hey, do you have a okay, boyfriend? You said no. Do you want to go on a date? No. But what if? But that's because the scenario wasn't real. But what if it was? You get me? What if it was? Nothing was going to happen. Bro, she can't handle it. David, like, who, who are you about to believe, yo? Like, me or him? Look, I don't care who you believe. I don't fight over hoes, but if you want a problem, yo, you we can fight. But I'm not saying that she's in the wrong. I brought her here so David. she could do a music, you know, sing, whatever. Now, you know, I'm going to leave. F this bitch. Like, she could find her own. Bro, right you know what? Seriously, yeah. that, bro. Hell no. Nah. I can't f the gold diggers. I'm out. Yeah. <laughs> guys as our very first episode back please do not forget to go show david some mad love on his instagram and his snapchat i love you guys and i'll see you guys next time <laughs>